Carrie's Fabric and Uniform Store is not just your leading uniform store. Carrie's has a huge selection of beautiful beaded laces and embellished fabrics perfect for weddings, proms, and evening dresses. Also find stretch lemores, stretch taffetas, scubas, neoprenes, upholstery fabrics, men's suiting material, and a whole lot more. Find evening bags, gloves, and rhinestone jewelry. That's Carrie's Fabric and Uniform Store on Mackey Street, a designer's paradise. Underway to address the stony coral tissue loss disease, a deadly and relentless plague ravaging the country's coral reefs. Reports say the outbreak of the disease began off the coast of Florida in 2014 and was detected in Bahamian waters several years later. Minister of Agriculture and Marine Resources, the Honorable Clay Sweeting, addressed this issue during his recent budget debate presentation in Parliament. Stony coral tissue loss disease is a concern for the Bahamas. This disease that is known for, to kill over 20 species of hard coral and can affect multiple sectors, including tourism and fishing, and with potential long-term impacts such as protection from storm surge. In response to the disease, the government of the Bahamas formed a task force to include the Department of Environmental Planning and Protection, the Bahamas National Trust, the Bahamas Commercial Fishers Alliance, the Grand Bahama Port Authority, the Parry Institute of Marine Science, the Ministry of Tourism, among others, was headed by the DMR. The task force seems to strategically work together to mitigate the severe effects of the rapidly spreading disease. Now, this disease has impacted reefs in the northern Bahamas. Many environmentalists believe the blue economy will be endangered if this issue is not tackled seriously. Meantime, the Minister of Marine Resources says the Department of Marine Resources will open a new office in Bimini this year to better police one of the country's main gateways. A part of the opening of the new office will be the commissioning of a 25-foot contender marine patrol craft. The purpose of the office and the commissioning of the marine patrol craft have to have an on-the-ground presence on an island, and that is considered to be the gateway to the Bahamas, eh? Yes. Large volume of pleasure and sport fishing crafts from South Florida year, crafts from South Florida year-round. The DMR will also commission another 25-foot contender marine patrol craft in Mangrove Key Andrus. And this marine patrol craft will be responsible for patrolling the waters adjacent to both Mangrove Key and South Andrus.